Good morning and join us for Photo Days Part 2 in today's episode of Behind the Closed Doors. I hope you enjoy today's episode and if you do, leave comments below and of course subscribe to our channel. Hey guys, I hope you enjoy today's episode. Photobomb! Weird. <laughs> One of the many questions we have about this area is why is there a staircase to the elevator? Why are there elevators if you still have to climb a staircase with your suitcases? Weird. And what's going on there? The magic of people finding out moisturizer for the first time. Yeah. Now in a new episode of Bizarre Things. Doesn't the dog is allowed to, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, and I don't know. Maybe somebody can explain. We're learning new stuff every day. Isn't it great, girls? I think it's an Advil or whatever. No. Advil? actually found a solution it's that you can't stay too close to the door because trust me the door is moving the door is not always open and we are now behind closed doors for the elevator and Nadine actually hates <laughs> elevators we are holding our breath. and yeah. you're very happy this isn't smellorama because I don't know what happened in here but it's yeah. really bad. They didn't notice oh. that design. Oh. Oh. As soon as you think that the air in a parking garage is fresh, you can imagine how bad it is in there. Oh. First up, the seminar from 10.15 till 11. And after that, a short break and lunch, we hope. And then we're gonna do three photo shoots with Nadine on the booth. And we have some really cool stuff planned out. Hair pieces. And I just saw that my laptop came online. So let's see what we can do. Part one done and now a few hours off and then at 1.15 the first demo with Nadine for Sony. Okay here you can see the steady shot in action on the X1000 VR. And you can see that it's actually moving the sensor so and I know because I use cameras like this and it's absolutely stunning.
Okay, so these are all pictures from frietkotten. Or in other words, this is where you can buy fries in Belgium. And we also have these in the Netherlands, but they're of course a little bit different. And these are older shots, really love this. Don't like fries that much, but these kind of shots I can really appreciate. It's like looking in a time machine. And that's what photography is, right? It's time machines. You're capturing a unique moments in time. Frozen moments in time that will never come back again. That's deep. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. It's always cool when somebody likes your car. Car center in an export. Good day, your car is interesting to us. Yeah, a lot of cars are interested to them. So don't believe them. It's about on every car here on the lot. Yeah, useless.
Okay, so that was the end of photo days day two. Do you hear that outside? We have helicopters, we have police. I think we're gonna turn on the TV and see what happens. Probably nothing, but you never know. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Behind the Closed Doors. We'll see you again tomorrow for the final day of photo days. Everything is quiet now, we couldn't find anything on the internet, so I think it was just maybe an accident somewhere. Hey, by the way, one of the things that we always try to do during trade shows, and you see that actually in these episodes, is do something new. And because we have a smaller space, it can be a little bit tricky. But if you visit one of those booth shows, you will actually see that you don't need a big studio to make great photographs. You just have to be a little bit creative with lighting. So this is really the end of today. So if you have a small studio, try to do everything you can with your lighting. And always remember, you don't need big spaces. Hey, see you again tomorrow. And again, if you like what we do, please subscribe and leave comments below. Bye, guys.